नमस्ते लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन एज अ पार्ट ऑफ इंट्रोडक्शन टू वेदास एंड उपनिषद्स एंड इट्स एग्जिस्टेंस को एग्जिस्टेंस फ्रॉम द व्यू पॉइंट ऑफ अ पौरशेया पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू लेट्स टेक द सब्जेक्ट फ्रॉम द साइकोलॉजी पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू and let's try understanding the subject to start with asya shri shuddha shakti mala maha mantrasya upastha indriyadi varuna aditya rishihi daivi gayatri chandaha satvika kakkara bhattarika peethasthita shrimad kameshwara anka nilaya shrimad kameshwari devata ऐं बीज क्ली शक्ति सौकीलक श्रीदेवी प्रीत्यर्थे खड्ग सिद्ध्यर्थे जपे विनियोग ऐं अंगुष्ठाभ्या नम क्ली तर्जनीभ्या नम सौ मध्यमाभ्या सौ अनामिकाभ्या नम क्ली कनिष्ठकाभ्या नम ईं करतलकृष्टाभ्या नम ऐं हृदयाय नम क्ली शिसे स्वाहा सौ शिखाय वट सौ कवचा हूं क्लीं नेत्रय वौ षट ऐं अस्त्रा फट भूर्भुवसुवरों दिग्बंद सर्वोकगोत्रोद्भव से क्षेम स्थर्य विजय भय आयु आरोग्य धर्म अर्थ काम्य मोक्ष चतुर्विध फल सिद्ध्यर्थे एज ऐ वॉज स्पीकिंग अबाउट द वेरी कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द ब्रेन फ्रॉम द वेरी फ्यू वेरी फ्यू पॉइंट ऑफ यू नो पीनियल ग्लैंड दट गिवज राइज टू इमोशंस एंड अदर थिंग्स आई थॉट let me give that a clear insight about it in regards to the current day consciousness study in the 21st century wherein we are failing to understand that bit of thing from the apaurshaya point of view because there is lot of gap between apaurshaya and paurshaya because perceptions vary and that is the reason why there is a very famous line spiritual truths are the only uh, uh, what you call uh, uh, fir- uh, only descendants and they are discerned by this elevated vision what is this elevated vision that i am talking about and how do you realize this this is where the trashta and trushya works and this is the very concept of sankhya philosophy which is what is called trik drushya and viveka it has been already told in vedas and upanishads maybe somewhere around uh, you know i would not go to billions and trillions years uh, back but uh, i would say lakhs of years back four and a half years lakhs back years back when uh, prototype was existing pre and post and that's when even that uh, you know complex structure of the kameshwara and kameshwari devi's existence also comes in the picture and i felt uh, this was necessary to be given introduction about because not uh, every one of us are aware of this including me which i could understand uh uh from the biological sense as well as from the psychological front if there is uh, you know psychology parapsychology and uh, you know meta psychology these two aspects play key role at the same time even that uh, you know clinical psychology which is what is existing in the clinical study of the psychology as well of the human existence as a whole think about it ladies and gentlemen 
this is a very critical concept that today we are missing upon and i just wanted to throw more light on that maybe you know this could give a small glimpse but maybe this could help uh, the researchers to understand from the classical dance perspective who is practicing classical dance be it any kind of fine arts mohini attam bharatnatyam kuchipudi or you name it whatever it is eight forms whatever that have been uh, recognized by sangeet natak academy maybe after the independence i don't know the dates correctly but uh, you know whatever it is spiritual truths why am i talking about the spiritual truths as a whole and what is the basis for this first let's try understanding this the cosmic consciousness today in this video let me talk about the cosmic cosmic consciousness why is this conscious cosmic consciousness i am talking about as i was comparing with the uh, 65 billion neurons uh, neurons to 100 billion galaxies in the multiverse they have that connection this consciousness and makara makara bija ma 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 sa pa ma ma pa sa sa re sa re sa re re sa sa re sa re ga sa sa re ga sa ma pa sa ma pa sa sa re sa re ga sa ma ga sa ma ma pa ni pani ma pani sa sa ni dha sa ni dha dha pa dha pa dha pa dha pa dha pa dha ni dha ni sa now logically what happens is the moment these swaras are enunciated and enunciated and you know stressed upon like you know these sounds when we say when we uh, stress upon that so called consciousness or that exists in the anu and the parmanu anu and the parmanu was a kind of in the multiverse and the same thing happens here jivatman and parmatman and this is where that cross relationship starts happening cosmic at micro level think about it ladies and gentlemen at macro level when you are trying to connect it is again all together strong ana and strong na these two are the sounds which get you connected ana 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 na na ni 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 re sa ni re sa why am i talking about this cosmic consciousness there is always that interrelationship of the human existence and human existence as well as the cosmic existence and this subject in fact has been spoken by and large again this has been misconstrued by the westerners they say with a different aspect giving that bombardment of that uh, white hole and black hole and incidentally incidentally and accidentally albert einstein's relativity theory is in concurrence with this in convergence with this thought process so from the psychology point of view if i really see i am not denying max muller or any westerner philosopher have explained them uh, explained these concepts in their own terminologies using this uh, shastras or upanishads but 
there is one thing that every philosopher or the theologist or the you know current day research scholars are missing is we are not going to that apaur shaya aspect understand this ladies and gentlemen this cosmic consciousness is all about that convergence of you or the unified or the unification of the body mind and soul directly or indirectly and thanks to we should be grateful to shankaracharya's works when he released his shloka brahma satyam jagat mithya brahma eva jeevo naparah again i will come to the same old thing and again it is again talking about kasmai devaya avisha vidhema that godly existence is there again and this is where that consciousness aspect comes into picture this consciousness is nothing but your soul understand this and when i talk about the con- uh, cosmic consciousness it is all about that uh, you know divine confluence or divine convergence of both human body as a whole to that higher cons- uh, cosmic energy levels which is billions and trillions of miles and nobody knows the form it is both formless and form it is having both formless and form and this is where the emotional intelligence comes into picture emotional quotient and the uh, you know intelligent quotient comes into picture think about it ladies and gentlemen it's a very hard concept and this is more easily explained in the natya shastra which was published by the rishis and munis again i am telling i am not trying to demean the researchers who are telling that uh, bharata has written natya shastra but i will say to my as per my research or as per my you know uh, uh, yoga uh, yoga drashtas uh, uh, images or you know output what i could understand is it is all about rishis and munis coming together and explaining the very complex existence of the human body and its connection to the higher cosmic consciousness at a higher level at a higher end think about it ladies and gentlemen however it has more determinants various determinants like you know uh, 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 transcendental and the normal one as i was telling like uh, you know it is uh, terrestrial interterrestrial intraterrestrial abysmal white hole black hole these are the stages of the multiverse wherein this consciousness directly or indirectly gets gets to that convergence point that unification happens at a higher level this cosmic consciousness the moment this starts happening or this starts developing this happens only through classical dance which they found out and saptasaras as i was explaining ana ana na 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 if we decipher and decodify these varas that's when you will be able to understand the very concept of that convergence or the confluence of the cosmic consciousness at macro level at micro level 
स्ट्रांग अना 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 नी धा 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 पा धा पानी सा मा समा 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 रे गमा समा 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 रे गमा पा think about it ladies and gentlemen it's not as easy as it is understood you will be understanding only through your antarmukha sadhana antarmukha samaradya bahirmukha sudurlava anima siddhe lagina siddhe maima siddhe ishitv siddhe vashitv siddhe in khatgamala Thus, I conclude this video with a positive note. Stay blessed. Have a real blissful life. May the Guru's grace be with all. Have a nice day ahead.